Yo, 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 what's up? It's your boy Da Vizzle, a.k.a. Sober Gang, alright? So for those that don't know, this is uh my windbreaker. This is I have it in hoodie form and in uh, jacket form. So if you want a Sober Gang jacket, come on and order you one. My message is simple. Drugs are not normal. Being addicted to drugs is not normal. Needing drugs to do anything is called chemical dependency chemical dependency is not normal i grew up in an era where drugs were the norm so i just really want to let all like the middle school and below know that like drugs turn you into a dope fiend and dope fiends talk to themselves and their families give up on them and drugs are bad they not normal they not necessary women don't want to stay married to you you feel me uh, uh, if you want all you that life has to offer, put the drugs down. That's what Sober Gang is about. The other part of it is just like, uh, you don't owe nobody nothing. So be a real man, you feel me? And stand on your own two feet. Make your own decisions. I've seen a lot of people get pressured into being drug addicts. They got pressured into doing drugs. They ended up drug addicts. So in my mind, they got pressured into that lifestyle that they didn't even want for themselves. So if somebody try to pressure you into being a drug addict, uh, stop hanging out with them. That's you know, and fellas, and if you dating somebody that's on drugs, you know, break up with them, leave them in the past. You know, I hear a lot of people, but the the love of my life on drugs, this and that. You don't need to be with somebody that's on drugs or gonna have you doing drugs. Drugs are a a stimulant. It's like a, a something that you need in your brain, an endorphin like a reward system that you should get when you work hard for something and get it in the long run. You see people win championship rings and they're like, oh man, I finally did it because they just work, work, working. Then you get yourself a championship somehow. So that's the meaning of life. And that's what drugs prevent you from doing. You do some drugs, you feel like you're the champion every night. No, that's not reality. Sober gang, that's my message, man. I love you guys and I'm out. Peace. Yo, 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 it's your boy Da Vizzle, and uh, I wanted to let all my followers from the Sober Gang TV know, yes, I am the street performer who spent all last year performing my album Reggae Punk, okay? Um, I wanted to talk about this because I'm a hip-hop artist. I just dropped a full album tape with Kelly Portis, and I really, Boom Bap is my genre of music, but... Uh, the reggae punk was something I invented. It's a blend between reggae music and punk rock. But because a lot of the songs are about partying and a lot of the songs represent a little bit different of a lifestyle than what Sober Gang represents now, uh, I got to remix some of the songs or throw some of the songs away. But uh, the smoking on the job is on this album. And, uh, you know... I really love doing music, man. I want to let all my music fans specifically know that I still do music. I'm not a gospel rapper. I am a diverse musician. At any day, I might drop a reggae song. I might drop a punk rock song. I might drop a po a poem. I might drop a hip-hop song. So one of the things I want to do is become one of the world's most diverse musicians, singers and rappers. Um, poets and MCs, and I'll end off by saying that I am a hip hop MC above everything. So appreciate y'all, man. Sober Gang is also a music group, so I just wanted to make that very clear, man. I'm out. Hey, hey, what's up, man? It's your boy Davizel, aka David, and um, man, I want to talk to you guys today about Create Skateboards. Create Skateboards is a San Francisco skate company, but it's also basically a board company. It's a skate team. They have a skate team, and two of the people on the Create Skate team are very special to me. They stand out to me a lot. The first one that I'm going to name, he's no longer with us. His name is Zay, okay? He had the world's highest ollie. Sponsored by Create Skateboards, all right? This is him ollieing over a car. Now, I just want to make it very clear. He didn't have no ramp on the other side of this car. He ollied over cars like this, no ramp. So, let it be known that the world's highest ollie was from a black skater 
okay, that went by the name Zay. And this is his board, all right? I got the In Loving Memory of Xavier Alford, okay, 9-26-97 to 5-7-2022. So he, um, last month he was gone for a full year. And if you want to support Zay right now, you can pull up to Create Skateboards and buy you a hoodie, shirt, or a board. So this board is pretty much getting me back into skateboarding. And also, the other side, this grip tape, is Poo Rail's professional grip tape. Poo Rail is from East Oakland. All right. He pretty much carries the skate legacy of a lot of Oakland skaters that you may never have heard of. And his style is woven in his style is is uh, some of the best Oakland skaters that never made it or that that didn't necessarily go pro. And he grew up watching and learning from some people that I grew up watching and learning from. So I would say keep your eye on Pooh Rail. Pooh Rail is my favorite skater. I think he'll be your favorite skater if you watch all his clips. The dude is he's too gnarly to describe. And uh he has a board as well. So if you want, you can pull up to create skateboards, ask for his board, and uh they might be sold out, but they also carry his grip tape. So ask for his grip tape, the board, and uh yeah, man, create skateboards. San Francisco Skate Shop. They're very special. They have a, a very unique plan of action. And I support this plan of action. It's really just to boost and elevate some local black skaters. And they're doing it. They're already doing it. And they're part of the reason why Zay is retiring professional. So buy his board and see the display that they have. They actually have measured up how high his ollie was right there. So you can see it for yourself. He he had the world's highest ollie. And, um, man, shout out to Pooh Rail. Long live Zay. And support Create Skate Shop. Um, that's all I got to say, man. Sober gang, I'm out. Peace.